All right, hi guys. So today we're unboxing the VIEC A15 Pro and we're gonna see how this looks and works with a Mac. This is a um, MacBook Air, as you can see. All right, so here we go. You'll have to excuse me, I'm one-handed doing this. So, okay, so we have the glove, the drawing glove that comes with it, cool. Cool, cool. And let's undo this. Give me one second. Seeing as I am, let me hand it. And just like that, we pop it out. And it's really thin, which is really nice. A lot of tablets, some of them can be kind of thick and bulky and just kind of more or less in the way on your desk. Um, but this one seems pretty nice. And lightweight, which is good because having a lightweight tablet helps a lot. So here we get a closer look. We can see the hotkeys here. We can see the power, the pen, the keys, the dial here, that sounds very nice. And as we can see, like, these clearly work. Very nice. And this one works, got our dial. Very nice, very nice, lightweight, really thin. I have tiny baby hands and I can hold this one-handed. <laughs> Seems easily portable, and let's just plug this in and see how it works. All right, so underneath the board and the uh, tablet, you have the, um, this is a nice little case for it, and it's a, um, it's the pen. Let me see if I can pull this out one-handed. <laughs> this is great. There we go, there we go. Alrighty, so there's the pen. Looks really good, pretty, you know, pretty similar to what I'm used to. And the nib looks good. The nib looks really good. So there's the pen. We have the carry case here. We have the cords here to connect it. We have the driver download, yay. Good to have a reminder card because sometimes you forget, sometimes you need to reinstall. Good to have that just in case. All right, let's see a pen holder. Let's see how that looks. Oh, not bad, not bad. Um, this is the nib case. Look at all those nibs. And these all appear to be there's a few of them of slightly different sizes, but most of them are the same size. Now you just look ever so slightly, like a little bit smaller. And let's see here, here's the start guide. Let's get that going. All right, so as you can see here, the um, power is on. The pen light gets better as soon as you like get closer to it. And for this, I'll be using um, this program. It's called Autodesk Sketchbook. It's an app for Macs. For, um, just so you know, um, for people using Clip Paint Studio, or Clip Studio Paint, I'm sorry, or Clip Studio anything, it doesn't work with that. For some reason, Clip Studio is the issue, not the tablet. So I'll just show you just a quick little hello, so you can see. I'm not used to not seeing what I'm doing as I'm doing it. So <laughs> I'm used to like drawing on the screen and not looking at it differently, but hello. And this is actually pretty easy to use. I like it. Um, as you can hear, like the pen doesn't like hit very hard on it. Like here, I'll just do something so you can see me doing it here. And 
and I just made a smiley face. So, as you can see, it works really smooth. Um, changing between different things is really nice. Um, I just can't really decide, like, <laughs> what to do. Because I'm just, I'm not used to, like, drawing like this, where I'm looking at a different screen than my hand. But this is really cool. This is really e easy to use. Um, easy install. Just like I said, you just follow the directions that they give you on their little card. And keep this because you'll need it just in case. <laughs> like anything happens like to your computer, to your art program <laughs> that's your favorite or something. You know, sometimes computers update and you don't know how compatible they're going to be with other things. So just kind of keep an eye on like how you're doing and your tablet's compatibility but so far this is like really good you have all your hotkeys and things here yeah i just want to finish up by saying that this is a great product for people who have never had a first time tablet or wacom's are too expensive um this is just really easy to use really easy to set up you literally just download drivers plug and go start drawing you're good to go like I said, it's just taking the time to figure out which programs are compatible because, like I said, not all art programs are compatible with it. So you just gotta take the time to just adjust to what you're used to and figure out, like, do I need another art program with this? Do I like my pro Do I like my tablet more? Or do I like my program more? Personally, I think it's better to adjust your, your program to your tablet. So just a piece of advice. It's a really good product. I like it. I am glad to see it working properly and even on a Mac. So yeah, this is a MacBook Air. So I just wanted to say one final thing. This is the A15 Pro. Thanks for watching. I'm Kemi and have a good day.